Hi, and welcome to today's Tuesday Tip. We're going to have a continuation of our summer series on MOR findings. So let's start with the exterior. As a part of the MOR, the reviewer is responsible for making sure there's not a lot of graffiti, garbage out, things of that nature. You want the property to look good because you want to attract the right type of residents. You don't want your trash being overrunning. You don't want old furniture laying out in front of the uh, trash recycle bin. You want to keep the property in excellent condition because what you see is usually what you get. The next thing we're going to talk about is the REACT inspections. As you know, REACT did inspections up until February of 2020. After then, the patent debit kit and we were not able to have REACT inspections. They have started back. But what you want to keep in mind is that the reviewer has to review the last REACT inspection and we review it to make sure that the deficiencies have been mitigated. The next, which is last but not least, are inspections. You can receive findings for not doing annual inspections. I think I mentioned once before, the HUD did not do away with annual inspections during the pandemic, so how you did them were kind of left up to you. But now that we have this little break, everybody should be doing their annual inspections. We also give findings for there not being a move in inspection form and the move-in inspection form not only needs to have the name of the resident signed by the resident and the date but it also needs to have the condition of the unit don't just have a blank sheet have some X marks or some checks to show that you and the resident actually went over the information and went through the unit and mark anything that was not acceptable to you and the resident if you don't have the resident to do the move out inspection with you, you can conduct it alone. The HUD handbook says that management has to sign and date the move out inspection, even if the resident did not. Hopefully you're enjoying these and hopefully everybody's making superiors and above averages or at least satisfactory on their MORs. And we'll see you next Tuesday for another Tuesday tip.